What is up everybody, I am your legendary commander here and welcome back to another episode of Art Survival Evolved. Today, we're going to talk about something that I happened to notice and that was, I was trying to get Flint. Flint's hard to get. Now it doesn't sound like, oh it's just grab a pick, hit the hit the rock with a pick and it gives you Flint or go get an egg, you get a lot of Flint. Well, when you're trying to get a lot of Flint, a lot of Flint, what's the best way to do it? What's the best dino to use? Well, we're going to look into it, and we're going to find out. Alright guys, so we have got two dinosaurs here today. We've got an Ankleo, and we got a Mantis. These guys are probably your best two miners. I don't think there's any other real miners that mine Flint. Uh, this guy right here, of course, has to have pitch in his hand, otherwise he's absolutely useless. They are both 150 Force Tames, and they have not been leveled, but you can see they have 73 levels available. So, what we're going to first do is we're going to level these guys up here. So, I have been told 540 is all the melee you want on your Ankleo. After that, you get capped off on Riding Rock. The rocks on Riding Rock seem to cap you off. Whether or not that's 100% true, I don't know. But we're also going to need mobility for, for the Ankleo. So, we're going to pump every other point into weight here. So, let's get that weight pumped up as high as we can. And I say for for flint, I mean, I'm actually referring to metal. Maybe there's a flint tank, and we'll have to discover that at some point later. But as of right now, we're just going to go ahead and find out for a metal tank. This is your metal tank right here. He's got 1,400 weight, 539% melee, because otherwise he's not getting any more effect. He just gets stronger, or she gets stronger, I should say. Over here, we're going to have no pumping to melee, because I've always been told never to pump melee on this thing, but just pump pure weight on this thing. And that's because it can't hold any metal. So you're going to need something that can actually hold some weight. So this Mantis can hold 25 pound, uh, 2,500 pounds of weight. What we're going to do is we're going to go hit some of these rocks and see what kind of metal returns we're getting. What brought this up in the first place though was I was harvesting and harvesting and harvesting and I was like god there's got to be a faster way. I'm so tired of moving around this slow ink. So we need to find out, can you collect any flint faster? Because you are moving pretty slow on an egg. Uh, if you're, uh, especially if you're overloaded, the next thing you know, you're starting to have to carry that weight with a bird and then hop from the bird. It's just not a fun time. And also it inc improves that mobility of the egg with the bird. So we can kind of see we're getting around 80 flint, 64 flint. Really we're not getting too much variety here. And now the optimal way to do this is to take a bird, drop it between a, a cluster of rocks, which uh, I tend to actually mine up there. But like get between this cluster of rocks here, any second now we'll be over there. and just mash them out like this. And we got 200 flint. Now, let's go ahead and hop on the Mantis. That ain't should be able to take care of himself. The Mantis has improved mobility. Unfortunately, there is a drawback of the Mantis. The Mantis doesn't reduce weight at all, so if it finds any metal or anything like that in these rocks, it tends to weigh down a little more. Unlike the Ankh, where it reduces that, but you have pure weight on your side here. It looks like offhand we're not getting as much. These are some journeyman picks. They are probably what you give the, the Mantis just so it had decent ones, but you can see we're able to move very quickly. And this is probably its most astonishing factor. We'll go back to the times uh, with mining and I'll tell you exactly how much time each one took. So guys, uh, with the results here, as you saw just previously, I feel like the Mantis actually is a much more effective dino for collecting Blint. And the reason for that is, is this mobility is much, much greater. Well, yes, you can collect a lot of Flint with the Ankh, and this is not discrediting the Ankh. The Ankh had melee pumped at least to 540, and here is the amount of Flint it gathered. Same time, the Mantis, with its amount of Flint, 
I mean, it, it just had so much more mobility. While I had to break more rocks to get the amount, and if you're on a limited uh, area, you would probably go with this if you don't have a lot to, of resources to use. But if you have wide open vast areas like on Ragnarok where there's basically stone everywhere, the Mantis seems much more like the kind of thing you might want. Pretty uh, sturdy here and uh, got a good weight. If you pack a set of swords on there for emergency cases, you're, you're in pretty good shape. Where the Ankh, uh, it's not a bad dino. It never has been. Very good melee and I mean, it does have a good weight if you level it up. But I mean, you can see the difference in mobility. I mean, that's just so much faster. And then you can also leap at targets and you can even use that leap sometimes to break, break metal or break a rock. Provided you don't. So guys, in conclusion, I'm gonna have to put uh, give the flint job to the mantis. If you don't have a mantis already and you are trying to gather flint, I highly suggest you go get this. Now I say this, but if you happen to know of a Ragnarok location where the, where the stone is so condensed that the ank doesn't have to walk very far, use your ank. Your ank is definitely gonna do you a better job. Whereas this mantis with no leveling to melee and just carrying a set of 180 picks was able to compensate and in the end, I feel it was much, much faster about getting its flint. But that's gonna be it for this video, guys. I hope y'all learned something, because that's kind of the goal of these videos, is to teach you something. So, I hope y'all learned something. Don't forget to like, subscribe, tell your friends, definitely tell your friends. Get me up to a thousand subscribers. The more subscribers I have, the more powerful I become, and the more I can make these videos for you. But like I said, that's all it for this video, guys. Y'all take care. That's not how you wave. And I'll catch you next time.